Hi everyone. Let us see the next concept. That is square root of non-perfect squares by estimation. Here means what that one square root of non-perfect squares by longer division method we learn up to three decimal places, up to four decimal places also we learn there. Here in this question, up to one decimal place only they are asking without long division by estimation method we are going to learn. Here what is this estimation method and how to do this one? Look at here, we have to find out the square root of 10 there. Square root of 10. Here, square root of 10 means this 10, the per, um, 10 lies between two perfect square, perfect square numbers. What are those? 10 lies between the perfect squares the perfect squares 9 and 16, right? Therefore, 9 is less than 10, 10 is less than 16, right? Otherwise, R, what can we write? 3 square is less than 10, 3 less than 4 square. That means, root I am applying on both the sides. Root 3 square is less than root 10 is less than root 4 square. Square and root just cancel, square and root just cancel. That means 3 less than root 10 less than 4. That means, what does it mean? Root 10 value lies between, lies between 3 and 4. Between 3 and 4. In between 3 and 4, there are so many numbers are there. Decimal places 3.1, 3.2, 3.3, 3.4 .3, and so on. So, how do we find it out? So, middle way we are going. For first, I am going to find out for, let us try for, let us try for 3.5. We know that, we know that 3.5 times 3.5 is, look at here, whenever a number is ending with 5, there is a method is there to find it out easily. First, 5 times 5 is how much? 25 I am writing there. Clear? 3. 3 after next number is what? 4. 3 times 4 is 12. So 12, 25. 1 decimal place, 1 decimal place, 12.25. Right? Now, 12.25 is, this is greater than, 12.25 uh, is greater than 10. Right? Therefore, what do I write now? 3 is less than root 10. Root 10 is less than 3.5. You understand? 3 is less than root 10. Root 10 value is less than 3.5. Is it clear? Now, what I mean, that means 3.5, whatever you have tried, it is not equal to. So, let us decrease the number and go. Now, what I am going, let us try for, let us try for, 3.4. That is 3.4 times 3.4 is how much? Multiply here. 34 times 34. 4 4s are 16. 4 3s are 12 plus 1, 13. 3 3s are 3 4s are 12. 3 3s are 9 plus 1, 10. 6, 5, 11. 11.56. This is also much more greater than 10. That is 3 is less than root 10. This is less than 3.4. Much more greater we got it. Now let us try for, let us try for 3.3. So it is 3.3 times, 3.3 is how much? 33 times 33. 3 3 is 9, 3 3 is 9, 3 3 is 9, 3 3 is 9, 9, 18, 10, 10.89. This is also greater than 10. So, 3 less than root 10 less than 3.3. Let us try for 3.2. 3.2 times 3.2 is how much? 3.2 times 3.2. 4, 6, 6, 9, 4, 12, 10.24. 10.24. This is also greater than 10. Let us try for 3.1. That is 3.1 times 3.1 is 9.61. This is less than 10. Now 
now once you observe 3 is 9 only so in between these two values which is little bit more than 10 and little bit less than 9 less than 10 in these two values look at here 3.2 and 3.1 which is nearer to 10 which value is nearer to 10 and here when you are comparing to 10 nearly 0.29 value is more and here it is 0.24 is less which is nearer to 10 3.2 is nearer to 10 therefore square root of 10 equal to 3.2 approx will write approx will write it is 3.2 value 10.24 is nearer to 10 than 3.1 that's why we are considering root 10 value equal to 3.2 up to 1 decimal place approx will write there approximately this answer will be 3.2 clear thank you